Yeehaw, we're going in. We're going down. We're going under. That's what we're doing. This is the hall. This is the east bedroom. East bedroom closet. This is the crawl space access. I had a little trouble. Sorry for the mask and the muffling. I had a little trouble getting this door open. This hatch open. It usually swells up because of humidity. Now, the moisture content in this floor, right here, where it's cupping, is about 21%. I ran water through the dishwasher, kitchen sink, both bathroom lavatories, bathtub and shower. Let's see what we can do. That's some pretty good space for these dowels. The ground feels kind of tacky. It is. Oh yeah, I can feel it. It's wet. This sill plate has been replaced. Sill plate's been replaced. You can see where the water's been running down. That's where the planter box is. And they went back with the right same thing. They they closed the they closed the darn weep holes on it. Okay, around here the perimeter on the other side of that wall. On the other side of that wall in Hillbilly Home Inspection, on the other side of the wall there is where the master bedroom is. And they didn't do a knockout. They built the floor up. I didn't see a crawl space knockout. The piers look all pretty good. This gas line right here, it's not properly supported. Let's see if we can get around this way. Back in the day, they used to shim these beams with wooden shims. That's no longer in favor. You see this cable I'm climbing that under? It's supposed to be supported better. It is. It's supposed to be supported better. Be better for me. This gas line, the gas line I said should have been probably supported. It should be just taken out. It's decommissioned. This bathroom horn. Let's see if I can get over there. The water supply line should have been insulated. Except for the sill plate. At one time, the clothes dryer was underneath here. You got some unidentified organic substance here. One time, the clothes dryer was it under here. Probably caused a lot of problems. Oh, there we go. How's that for some electrical? Open junctions, electric cables on the ground. Then the plumbing, water supply line anyway. Going to the laundry is PEX that's not properly supported. See all that PEX down there? It's supposed to be insulated and supported. And we got some more sill plate by the back door. That's not unusual. Okay, some sill plate replaced there. Well, we don't have any rain gutters. It just splashes back up on it. Yeah, that happens. Water heater plumbing. Okay. Well, I'm not going to get in that way. I'm going to get underneath that bathroom. I'm going to cut this off so I can take some still images and then I'll pick it back up. Parts A and B.